Hey guys, it's Mick Schwack. Um, I've been away for a while. Um, hold on, I gotta fix something. That's better. What's up guys, it's Mick Schwack, and I have been away for a very long time, and I apologize for that. So, in this video, I am going to explain to you why I've been gone for so long. I know I've done, like, so many of these, but I promise you, this one's a good one. Because I've got some great news at the end of this one. So, bear with me, guys. So, um, let's just start with the the ugly. Okay, let's, let's start with the ugly part of this. Um, I don't even know how to, like, approach it. Um, I'm just going to go out there and, and say it because I want to get this topic out of the way. Just so you guys are aware, um, I lost my mother-in-law. Um, my mother-in-law was diagnosed with cancer. And when it was discovered, it was honestly kind of too late. Um, after being diagnosed with it, I, I, I can't even give you the exact timing because it, it felt like it happened so quickly. Um, I want to say she honestly went in like two months. Like, um, they just, they found it everywhere in her and she ended up going to the hospital and the last time that I saw her in the hospital it was just instantly reminding me of my grandma when she had cancer and when I saw her in that way I knew it was coming. Um, she went I want to say it was like four or five days after I last saw her. Um, she did go in her sleep so that was the, that was the be the best part about it, and as as hard as it is to say, I'm actually glad that she went um, as quickly as she did. I know that sounds terrible, but it's mainly just because I know that she wasn't in pain anymore, and that's the hardest part of this video. But I promise you, there's good news. <laughs> um, but yeah, I just wanted to let you guys know that I did lose my mother-in-law. It's been really rough. Um, my wife had the hardest time with it. I mean, you, I mean, can you blame her? She lost her mother. My father-in-law had a really, really hard time with it as well. Um, he lost his one true love, and it's it's just been rough. I, I don't I'm, I don't really want to say that much more about it. It's just it's been rough. We're slowly moving on. There isn't a day that we go by that we don't think of her. We miss her. We love her. But it is the sad truth that it did happen, and it's prolonged a lot of stuff. Um, now for a little bit more of like better news <laughs> to try and move things along. Um. So, a lot of you guys might know that I have been going to school and working at the same time. And on a lighter note, um, come, I think I have like a month, maybe. I Honestly, I think there's only like maybe nine weeks left. Um, I will graduate from my class and I will become a licensed butcher. So that's fantastic news. This has been a year-long process of going to school, um, just hitting the books on the history of being a butcher and the different types of meats and where they come from and how to butcher a cow and how to butcher sheep and pig and it, you name it. We've been studying it. And in June, I will graduate and I will be a licensed butcher. So... Um, that's fantastic, because once I get that, I can go anywhere and make some really good money. So that's one of the good things that has been happening. Um, something even better about what's been going on with me, um, I never actually made a video to announce it, and I'm kind of too late on it. Um, 
I'm having another baby, guys. <laughs> I mean, I kind of hate to say it like that and say, like, I'm having another baby. Like, this is the announcement video. Um, it technically is, but also, this baby is due any day now. The, the, he's coming. Yes, it is a he. Um, he will be here literally any day. Um, I don't know what day this video will be put up. Um, his due date is the 24th of May. Um, it is the 12th of May uh, at the time of this recording. But honestly, um, my wife is full term. Like, he's dropped. He's ready to go. He can come literally any day. Um, yeah. So... That's super exciting, so I've been preparing for that. Um, it gives me so much joy. And and some of you guys know about my daughter. Um, she is now six, and uh, she's super excited. She can't wait to have a baby brother. And um, now I've got one boy and one girl, and it's going to be exciting. And because my life has been just honestly everywhere... Um, I'm excited to say that I am going to be making more videos, but I'm doing a redirect, guys. Um, I'd like to still do some gaming videos, but I honestly don't know how many of those I'm going to be doing. Um, this channel is going to be mainly turned around to just being a dad and doing dad things and and maybe some, like... I don't know, things that I'm interested in. I mean, as much as I love video games, I I love woodworking. I love, uh, you know, cooking. I love grilling. Like, it's going to be more being a dad and just basically a day in a life is is what this channel is probably going to more so become. Um, maybe something kind of like Roman Atwood when he started his uh, Smile More. Um, I don't know. But I'm super excited. I can't wait to show you guys, and I can't wait to do so much more. I wish I had more to give you guys, but that's really where I'm at right now, is just, I've got a baby coming. I, I can't wait to spend more time with my family, because now that I'm no longer going to be going to school and working constantly, I'm going to have more time for videos. I'm going to have more time for my family, and it's exciting stuff, guys. I can't wait. I really can't wait. It's going to be awesome. Um, yeah, I, I don't know how to really end this, guys. And um, it's going to be fun. I hope you guys stick around. I hope you guys uh, let me know in the comments what you guys think. And uh, let's bring back McShwack. <laughs> because, boy, he's been gone for a long, long time. And I can't wait. So I can't wait to see you guys in the next one, and uh, as always, stay awesome. Hey, if you're still here and you guys haven't clicked away, go ahead, check out the channel, see some of the old stuff that I've been doing. Let's introduce some new stuff. Go ahead in the comments, let me know what you guys think you guys are more interested in. Like I said, I wanna show you guys my family more. I wanna show more of grilling. I want to show more of, you know, just woodworking and tinkering and doing stuff with my hands. Also, bonus for anybody that's still watching this video, I've been picking up magnet fishing, so I think we might have some, uh, some videos coming here soon on that. So, uh, please hit that subscribe button, ring the bell so you guys get notified, and interact with me, guys, because I want to interact with you. Really, go click that subscribe button. Ring the bell. Stay awesome.